Hello and welcome back to another episode of Age of Wonders 3. Let's go ahead and end our turn here. We're ready to assault. You know what? What the heck is going on here? She's moving her units out. Well, that's beautiful. That's perfect. What the heck is she doing? Okay, so they're, they're like coming towards us now, so this is perfect. We're just going to snipe them here in the uh, Baron Terran too, so we're going to be able to, to uh, have a pretty good advantage. I want to keep an eye out on this guy. Do we have units guarding here? Oh crap, I don't have any units guarding there. Oh boy, things are getting rough. Okay, 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 hold on here. I don't have any units guarding this place. We have to destroy this guy. <sighs> We're gonna have to try for it here with the uh, with this army here. But before we do that, I'm gonna use Vargan. Actually, I'm gonna position my units. You're gonna come here. You are gonna come here and attack. The probable victory, so we should manual this. Let's go ahead and manual combat. We are in Baron Terran, so we're going to have an advantage. We sort of have them surrounded. This should be an interesting combat, actually. Let's see what she does. Oop. Rust strike. Crap. Okay, Vargan's being attacked. So these guys are probably going to just cast the fireball. There we go, as I thought. There we go. Okay, so they're flanking this way. Okay. 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 And the settler's going to retreat, of course. Okay, so we got to do this very carefully here. Okay, so these guys are monster hunters. Uh, these are berserkers. I'd like to probably charge in there. These guys are guarding. So, and these guys have 50 hit points. What do we got here? We got some razor bows. I don't mind losing the razor bows. I mean, we're going to lose units. It's... It's for sure. So what we're going to do is move you guys here, get three shots. Okay. 35 hit points. You can almost maybe kill them. There we go. Nice. That's a good kill. These swordsmen are going to just walk up to these guys and take some hits. Actually, is that what I want to do? We got some berserkers here. We got more razor bows. If I move these guys here. Actually, move here. Get this attack here. Good. The swordsmen. And we got the berserkers. Okay, let me move the swordsmen up here. I mean, we're gonna take a lot of damage. I don't want them to move here. I want them. Here. Attack. Okay, that was like an even trade-off. Now I want you guys to back up to get the charge, the flank, and everything. You won't be able to kill them, though. It's close. It was close. So that's what happened there on that side. I mean, we might lose all these units, but it's not the end of the world. Now on this side, we should be able to do this very efficiently. So what Vargan is going to do actually is move in the back. Is that what I want to do though? We got these guys that can charge in there. They got a 60% chance to bleed them. Shock Trooper, Berserker, got some priests. Let me move the priests here. Get 10 damage there. 11 damage actually, good. And then we got some Shock Troopers. I don't want the shock troopers to take damage, though. 
There's an outside chance that we can kill this unit with the shock troopers. Uh, the berserker, you might as well come here into cover. You can't do much more. Shock trooper. Well, actually, I could come in there and get the kill for sure. So do that. <laughs> Get the kill. We actually healed because of the new sword we have, which is awesome. Now these two units should be able to do this. I'd rather have the berserkers go in first, though. Move here. Get the shot. 26 damage. You guys can move in there now. Get the damage. Good. And this shock trooper can come here and defend. Uh, anything we can cast? No, because we've moved already. Okay, so there we go. Next turn. They're going after Vargan. That's fine. Vargan's not going to die. Hey, cool. There we go. We lost a unit, but that's okay. I mean, I knew we were going to lose some units. And I don't mind losing units, actually, just to, to reduce our maintenance, overall maintenance, because I want to upgrade to better tiered units. So there we have it. So what am I going to do here? Let me finish this side first. This one is going to be a bit easier. So the Berserkers can move here. This should be a flank. I won't get the kill. This Berserker... We got the Priest, actually. Let me move the Priest here. Get some damage done. Good. Now we can... Actually, I'd rather have the Short Trooper level up, if possible. I don't want to take damage, though. Oh, it's only 5 damage. It actually ended up being 3 damage, so there we go. Move these guys here, and defend. Now Vargan can make his way here. And probably shoot this guy, actually. Which we will do for the kill. There we go. And Berserkers can uh, start marching here as well. These Berserkers... Might... Not be able to kill this guy. Let me weaken them. There we go. Now I might be able to kill them. There we go. Nice. Although they leveled up and we're going to lose them, but still, not the end of the world. Now, if this guy moves out of the way, I am okay. So back him up one. Get some shots here. There we go. You can go ahead and do the same. The razor bows here. That's not much damage. Damn, those razor bows are crap. Well, you might as well back up one. There we go. Shock Trooper. Start moving up. That's it for this turn, but we should be able to have this next turn. No problemo. And this is, this is going to end up being a very important battle, actually. Because now they don't have anything guarding their city. Now, let's try not to lose too many units. Um, if you move... This is a flank. Do that. Oh, you still have units here, I didn't notice. Okay, 23. Yeah, we're gonna have to kill those guys. Move here. Get the shot in. This guy can probably... Maybe kill. It's a berserker. I'd like to maybe keep him alive, though. Then again, Vargan's too far away to do anything. Move him here, and anything I can cast. Actually, there is something I could cast. Uh, the Gravest Wounds can't stop a warrior from fighting to protect them, which they believe in. Okay, so uh, for three turns, prevents the unit's health from dropping below one. I'm going to cast this on the Berserker. There we go. Now this Berserker can go in there. 
As far as I know, he can't die for three turns. Which ends up being a pretty awesome spell, really, if you think about it. You guys can defend. You guys can start marching in and defend. You can defend as well. Defend as well. And defend. Actually, you know what? Let me do curse. Can I curse? No, can't curse from here. Just defend. Doesn't really matter. They only got one unit left. There we go, 18 damage. And that's what they chose to do. That's interesting. Actually, I might as well have someone run down the, uh, the settler over there. Stay there. So this Berserker can't die, as far as I know. Let me test it. Oh, there we go. We killed him. There we go. Well, actually, no. Combat's not over. What am I talking about? We'll just do, uh... And turn, and turn, and turn, and turn, and turn. We'll chase this, uh, this settler down. I really hate this part of combat, though. When there's a stupid settler in combat, it just runs away. Then you have to kill it. It should automatic automatically die. I mean, what's it going to do in combat anyways, right? It's not going to do anything. It can't run away, so it, combat should just end when there's only a settler left. But anyways, it's dead now. We got the flank. What? Did I just lose my unit? Okay, I'm going to have to rewatch the video on that one. Why did I lose my unit? Oh my god. Bargain. Actually, you guys are closer. Might as well move these guys as well. How come I lost my unit there? That doesn't make any sense. Ah. I'm super angry. Defend, defend. Next turn. That was weird though. Why? Why did I lose my unit? Why? Why? Why anything? Oops. Defend, defend, defend. See, this is what I'm talking about. This is just stupid now. This is just prolonging combat for nothing. Although, apparently, the settler can kill things. You're not going to get any retaliation. There, I'll kill it. What the heck? It killed my unit again. Did it have something cast on it? Ah, I think there's a spell for that. Oh my god, that settler turned out to really screw me. I wish I hadn't used my... Uh, I still have my uh, shock troopers. I still have two berserkers and uh, my priest. We only lost two units. Hang on a minute here. So I didn't lose my units in combat. They just disappeared. Probably some kind of glitch, maybe? Perhaps? Okay. Now, next phase is the dangerous phase. These guys are obviously going to try to take over the city. So we have to move these guys and hope we win. Probable victory. Well, I like the odds. Except these guys are strong. Manual combat. I don't trust the auto on this one. When it's probable, oh my god, this is not the terrain we want to be fighting in. <laughs> it's all marshy. Okay. Or swampy, marshy, whatever. Whoa! Nelly! Okay, well, I, you guys want to play hardball. We're going to play hardball, too. Killer instincts. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Leader, it's double the cost. Well, you know what? We can... We can cast it. We can cast it twice, actually. I'm going to do that, actually. I'm going to cast this on my... Razor bows? No. No, they're all ranged units. That's true. That's kind of stupid. No, maybe that's not what I want to cast. Hang on. Hang on a second here. Last stand. Uh, bestows this dragon for a bolt. No, we don't care about that. Berserk, if it worked, that'd be great, but I doubt it's going to work. Can't be affected. As I thought. Shout Intimidation. Phoenix Warrior. What's the difference with Phoenix Warrior? When a unit dies, it is resurged at the end of combat and its owners is there. 
Hmm. I don't know which one's better. Steedfast or Phoenix Warrior. This reheals at the end of combat. This one just prevents the unit from dying flat out for three turns. That is interesting. I'm gonna actually I'm gonna cast this. I got the stuff. Let me put it on the priests. On this priest here. Okay, so you go ahead and attack. Well, move up one. Cannot be affected. Oh yeah, they're immune to blight completely. Crap. Oh my god, this we're gonna lose this. We are definitely gonna lose this. Okay. Um how much can you guys move? You can move a lot. Back up. Back up. You guys are fine here. Just stay there. You can't die for three turns. So you're going to actually stay there. I don't think they can do anything in combat, though. Well, they got melee, so that's something. You... You're gonna come behind him, alert. Same for you. I'm not sure how I'm gonna win this combat. I should probably have done auto. What the heck? They're just... killing things. There we go. Hmm. Let's go ahead and cast this again. Steedfast Ward is really gonna... Really gonna help us in this combat. Now let's go ahead and attack. You can't do anything, you can't do anything anymore. Um... Razor bow. Take some shots. Move here. Damn it. Move here. This is gonna be so hard. So hard. I might as well just move you in there and attack. Next turn. Let's see how this works out. Oh god, the fireball. Okay, they're gonna kill off the razor bows. How much hit points do you have? 23, you have 55. Okay, let's finish this guy here. If we can. Oh, come on! You couldn't do it. There we go, this will finish him off. Okay, now I'm a little worried though. Now we're gonna lose our steed fast, or steadfast. Shh. Son of a bitch. We can't cast anything anymore, so now we are screwed. Probably gonna lose this combat. Twenty-seven. Well, that's it for him. Uh, let's shoot. Let's hope. Let's just hope for glory now. He's almost dead, though. So even if we do lose this combat, these guys are hard, man. Holy crap! This, I had the worst possible army to, to fight these guys. Can't back up though. Nah, we're dead. He's just gonna retaliate and kill us one shot. I might do four damage on him though. Let's try that. We got three damage. So this guy is almost dead. He wiped out com our com uh, the army completely. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do here. I still have ten points to cast. What's this? What am I casting here? Oh, the Dunction is ready. Or the, uh, Disjunction, rather. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna do that right now. Cast. Oh, 
Oh, we just... No, yeah, that's right. We set it up for this turn. Um, you know what? Abort spell for now. Yes. Go in there. Raise militia. Oh, it's one turn. Oh, that's right, because I'm out of things. Damn it. Abort spell. Well, we're going to lose this city. How much movements do these guys have? 32. Yeah, we're probably going to lose this city. God damn it. Is there anything else that I can do? Oh, this guy. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Let me auto. Ooh, it was close. All right, we did it. Phew. We survived it. Okay, now I want to... This, uh, this junk... This uh, thing. Okay, now we can start this turn finally. <laughs> That was that was tricky, but we got it done. This place needs serious units ASAP. And um We're gonna have to put some more razor bows and everything. Whew. This is getting tough. Actually let me send these guys back in just for now. Hero leveled up, okay that's good. So we leveled up our good buddy Vargan, and I'm definitely gonna go now with the wall climbing. No, not wall climbing. Um, what was it? Oh, charge command. There we go. All units in this hero's army gains charge. So now we just fill up the Vargan with some um, shock troopers. And they're going to be exactly like berserkers, only better. Because they'll have charge as well now. So we're going to do that. Good. We have only one in there. These guys, we might as well start marching back up here. You keep building these guys. We need a lot more. We're going to do that. I almost feel like rush building these guys. You know what? I think I might do that. Okay, anyway. So, yes. Uh, close. Good. Uh, yeah, we got this guy. That's true. So, he's just going to make his way back. He could stay there. We got the Dark Citadel built here. Um, change production... It took long to get that uh, thing built. I might as well do more of these, I think. Let me queue up three of them. Queue up three of these. You've built the temple. That's fine. You can keep building that. You can keep building that. Search a new spell. So the caster's units gain plus 200 and cannot desert. Or desert, yeah. Okay, select new research. Easy things. Things that will help. Blight Empire. No, we don't want that. Uh, no, I, enemy at the gate right now doesn't really make any sense. Domain of Corruption. Tiger Family City now likes Blight Terrain. No, we don't care about that. Bloodbath. Um, incites troops to take down their enemies in the most brutal ways imaginable, leaving nothing but a red-stained battlefield. Bestows plus five strength on all friendly units. Yes, I want this. Yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this. Then again, warfare, warfare uh, four might, might be good. It's only two turns. Let me do warfare uh, four, and then I'll do the other one so that uh, we can do more damage, more melee damage. Okay, what's this? What? 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 Okay, you've grown. Good. So what we're going to do is... Uh, yeah, we're going to end this spell. There we go. So now we're saving some mana per turn. We don't really need it bigger than this. Um, who else has grown? You have grown as well. You know what you need, though? You need some... Razor bows. And what's the... Okay, so now you're part of our uh, city, uh, of our empire. Good. What do you got in there right now? You got a barracks. Nothing else, really. So let's do shrine. Let's do storehouse. Laboratory. I probably won't b bother with the builder's hall. Let's just get the basic buildings in this place. You are coming back. You. I'll press M. 
Executing move. Okay. You can pick up uh, an item. Holy crap, you got all this? Really, is invisible on strategic map. <laughs> yeah, equip. Accessory slot. Strong will, this unit is immune to mind control effects and at 100% protection against holy damage or something? Yeah, equip this as well. Put this here. Lightning wand. And another bow. Wow, that hero had a lot of uh, a lot of uh, things. How much how much does this do? Okay, so this we don't need this. I'm gonna go ahead and transfer this to her, I guess. This I will transfer to our good buddy him. So what does this do? This does. It's long. It's really crappy though. It doesn't shoot three times, but it's long range. I don't really need this. Let me... I guess I'll transfer it to... Uh, there we go, to you. There we go. So we just got much stronger. So we're invisible, which is awesome. On the strategic map. Okay, good. Good to know. What do we got here? Okay, you two are going to just jump in this army. For now, because we can probably take care of this city now. So, you move in there. Grab them. We got a... That's a pretty good army, actually. We got some berserkers. No, oh, this is a very strong army. See, we're invisible right here. You can see it says... Nice. Really awesome. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, this, play, this guy won't be able to do anything here. I won't be able to actually build a thing because of the raised city. So you might as well just come back here and build a road. We want to build it here, so you come here. There we go. An army needs orders. Oh, no, you're just still going to wait. Actually, uh, let me look at your uh, gear. So you're going to get this. you got three different ranged weapons, which <laughs> doesn't really help us all that much, but whatever. Go ahead and keep that. Army needs movements. We're gonna send you upwards. I thought I told you to stay put. Okay, so this is the builder. Yeah, you're gonna go over there, so do M. To keep going where you're supposed to go. This settler is gonna go up here. I'll move him myself. There we go. That's the end of this turn, and you know what? It's time for a cut in this episode. Thanks for watching. See you all next time.